ingredients to get to know God. Ingredients to get to know God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Turn up for God. Hey y'all. Welcome to Weed and Barley. This is a place where you get the ingredients to get to know God. I am Maxine. Welcome to this platform. I am here to give you a mighty word today. Praise God. The Lord has given it. Hallelujah. And I pray that it is a blessing to you. If you are new to the channel, welcome. This is the place where we just get along with the Holy Spirit. We just move right on in the things of God. Hallelujah. And if you are returning, praise God, welcome back in the mighty name of Jesus. We're just going to go ahead and get to it. We thank the Lord today for this joining together. Praise God. We thank the Lord today for the word and the messages, oh Lord God. Hallelujah. We thank you today, oh Father. Hallelujah. Thank you for leading us and guiding us in all of our ways. And thank you for the unfolding of this message in Jesus' mighty name. We pray. Amen. And hallelujah. We're just going to dive right in, y'all. So we're going to Luke chapter 19 and we're going to look at verses, um, I believe it's 30, 37 and 38. Praise God. Verses 37 and 38. Hallelujah. And remember for the days of the 18th, 19th, 20th, 20th and 21st, we are going to be like that. That's what the Lord says. We're going to be like that. So we are looking at various examples in chapter 19 of Luke and the Lord is really highlighting particular examples for us to be like. Praise God. These are great examples of submission. And because our fast is a consecrated fast, it is submitting, hallelujah, to Jesus Christ, then we are moving in that yielding to him. So he's given us these examples to follow and to apply to our life. Praise God for the Lord. Hallelujah. And as we move in these things, let's be committed to them. Let's not just do them one day today, praise God, and then just fall off the next week. Let's be committed to them. Let's make them a part of our routine, our daily routine. Let's make it a habit, hallelujah, to do these things that God is calling us to do. He said, be like that. He didn't say be like that for a day, be like that for a minute, but be like that, praise God, which means that it's a part of us. It's who we are. Hallelujah. I'm just so grateful to the Lord that he's moving us right along in his calling and his teaching. Praise God. Hallelujah. So that we can be planted on firm, solid ground, doing what he's called us to do. Hallelujah. I just, I'm so grateful to the Lord. Okay. So let's look at 19, chapter 19 of Luke. And we're looking at verse 37 and 38. I'll go ahead and read. 37 reads, and when he was come nigh, even now at the descent of the Mount of Olives, the whole multitude of the disciples began to rejoice and praise God with a loud voice for all the mighty works that they had seen, saying, blessed be the king that cometh in the name of the Lord, peace in heaven and glory in the highest. The title of this message is praise like the disciples. Be like that. Say it one more time. Praise like the disciples. Be like that. Today on your mission, praise God, of fasting, you are eating clean. Remember, you're doing away with bottom feeders like crab and shrimp and um, lobster, uh, pork, things like that, praise God. But you're going to move in a healthy eating style. You can eat during this fast, y'all, praise God. So you can eat the, the fruits, the vegetables. And if you eat meat, praise God, keep it at a minimum, you know, keep it at a, a smaller portion, it should not overtake your plate, praise God. Hallelujah. It should be more meat on your plate than size, right? So make sure that you are keeping, um, you are adhering to this, praise God, because the Lord is calling us to a greater uh, place. And remember, the Lord said that our bodies will be healing some things, praise God, but he will also be healing some things during this time. So we just want to adhere to clean eating and just making sure that we're on the right track with the Lord and what he's calling us to do. Hallelujah. Because the Lord will call us to do certain things. He'll call us to do away with certain things, praise God. Hallelujah. Depending on our makeup and what our bodies are yearning for, calling for. Hallelujah. Because we have nutritional factors within our body, right? So we need to make sure that we're following the um, nutritional plan that God has given us because there's a season, hallelujah, that he has set before us and we got to enter that season the way he's calling us to enter it, praise God. And that's also with a healthy body, hallelujah. So I'm just so grateful today that the Lord is calling us to this uh, position because he knows best. Also, make sure you're drinking water. Yes, drinking water, praise God, hallelujah. Don't overdo the water, but definitely drink water in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. And so the Lord is telling us to praise like the disciples in this time. So as you're consecrating, you are reading the word, you're meditating on the word, you're praying, you're listening to what the Lord is saying, hallelujah. And even those of you who are worshiping, praise God, hallelujah. 
You know, just remember, praise God, that in this time you're praising the Lord. You're, you're bless Jesus. Holy, holy, holy is Jesus. King of kings, bless the Lord at all times, praise God. Hallelujah. You want to make sure that you're continuously blessing the Lord. You're continuously praising the Lord because he said, be like that. Be like the disciples in this moment where they're constantly praising him because it's a triumphant entry of the king. See, this is uh, pre-death. Right. So they're praising him because, you know, he's coming into what he was called to do, which is to die on the cross for us. Praise God. But this is pre. So they're praising him before he even died on the cross. So we are here after the fact, praise God, after the resurrection. Hallelujah. After all the miracle signs and wonders he's done. Hallelujah. On this earth as he was walking and living as a man here. Praise God. So we should have, a, I would say, a greater praise. Praise God. We should be praising, 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 honoring, glorifying him. Hallelujah. Praising him. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Giving him that. Giving him that in the mighty name of Jesus because he rightfully deserved it, y'all. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, it's nothing that we can do to earn anything from Jesus. He doesn't owe us anything, praise God. He paid the price. He doesn't owe us anything, hallelujah, but we can praise him. We can honor him, hallelujah. He was the best choice, the only choice who could ever do what he did for us, praise God. We can honor him. We can praise him, hallelujah. And he said, be like that. Praise him like the disciples in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I pray that you believe it and receive it today. As you're moving along in your fast, just know to add the praise on the praise God. And if you can, if you have been praising, continue to praise. Just add it on, y'all. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus, because the Lord is calling for it today. Apply this word to your life in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God, for this message. Thank you, Lord God, for just going ahead of us. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God, for being the beacon of light in our lives that we need. Thank you, Lord God, for your instructions. Thank you, Lord God, for teaching us and showing us how to be like the disciples in praise. Hallelujah. I love the fact that you're showing us the examples out of this book of Luke, Lord God, of chapter 19. You're showing us the examples of what to be like. And we're just so grateful because we are in this fast for submission. Hallelujah. We are submitting to you, yielding to the spirit. Hallelujah. And we want to know how, Lord God, how are we to do these things? What are we to do? What does it look like? And you're giving us solid examples for us to follow. And we're grateful for your teaching, even in this, oh Lord. Thank you for the structure that you're providing for us, oh Father God. Thank you for being so good to us, oh Lord. We give you all glory, honor, and praises, oh Lord God. Anyone, hallelujah, who is receiving you today for the first time, oh Lord God, I just pray right now that they receive your love, they receive the elevation and increase, Lord God, that you have for them, oh Father God, that they hear you clearly, that they have clarity, that anything holding them back from you, oh Lord God, that those things will be broken off, uprooted, hallelujah, and devoured, hallelujah, in the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah, but they will not hold them back from you, oh Father God, in Jesus' mighty name. I pray right now, Lord God, hallelujah, that they are free and free indeed in Jesus' mighty name because they found you who is Jesus Christ and your blood washes clean. I'm just so grateful for you, Lord. I'm so grateful for you. And Lord God, every single person who's interceding, every single person who's continuing to pray, continuing to fast, oh Lord God, I pray for strength for them, oh Lord God. Send the angel of the Lord to strengthen them, oh Lord God. Give them what they need, the resources, hallelujah. Pour in love into their lives, oh Lord God. Show them clearly where they are headed in the mighty name of Jesus so that they they are not swayed from side to side but they have that clarity they need in order to navigate this realm oh father God we're just so grateful for what you're doing in our lives in Jesus mighty name may you have your way with our lives may we submit to you the way that you want us to submit the way that you like us to submit oh father God hallelujah we are so grateful for you in Jesus mighty name may our praises reach the heavenly realm oh God may you incline your ear to our praises today hallelujah may we praise you like you want us to praise you. Hallelujah. We're just so grateful, oh Lord God, in Jesus' mighty name. We love you, we honor you, and we glorify you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pray that you are blessed and I pray that you move in the things of God knowing that he is God and God alone. Praise God. He is the only one, a true living God, right? So we're going to move in the things of God today. Let us be blessed, hallelujah, in all of our ways knowing that we are highly favored in the land. We belong to the body of Christ, praise God, and we are yielding. All right, y'all, praise God. I will see you at 6 p.m. for communion today. This is day 20, hallelujah. Remember to be like that. Who are you being like today you're being like the disciples who praised Jesus hallelujah so your praise will be a high praise today in Jesus my name be blessed y'all I'll see you at 6 p.m love y'all